This is Sports News Africa Express. Here is a quick run through of some of the headlines in African sports with me, Angela Agor. We start with Kenya, where the Football Federation's president, San Nyamwea, has refuted claims of a rift between the Federation and broadcasters MP and Silva. Nyamwea's comments followed reports the media company were looking to renegotiate a new deal in light of the resumption of the more attractive Kenyan Premier League, where the biggest clubs like Goma here and AFC Leopards play. Genzebe Dibaba has made history by becoming the first Ethiopian athlete to win the prestigious Laureus Sportswoman of the Year award at an event in Shanghai on Wednesday. The middle distance runner received the award for setting indoor records in the 1500 and the 3000 meter races last year. South Africa rugby international flank Skulkberger was also honoured with the Comeback of the Year award. Nigeria and Ivory Coast are through to the semi-finals of the African Beach Soccer Championship in the Seychelles after winning their accumulating six points each from their first two games. Host Seychelles and Egypt have both suffered consecutive defeats. Madagascar stunned defending champion Senegal 3-2 after extra time while Morocco dealt Ghana their second defeat as well. And finally, Manny Pacquiao pronounced himself fit and ready to fight Lloyd Mayweather in the ring. He says he's willing to engage the unbeaten American in the middle of the ring if that's what it takes to win. Pacquiao held an open day training session in Los Angeles, California on Wednesday, ahead of the eagerly anticipated May the 2nd welterweight unification showdown in Las Vegas. And that's your Sports News Africa for today. That's your Sports News Africa Express for today. For more on these stories, you can also follow us on Twitter or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye for now.